Well, good afternoon, everybody. It is uh, terrific to have you along for our live coverage of this uh, eagerly awaited contest. It should provide some terrific entertainment on uh, what is turning into a rather imperfect afternoon. The weathermen really get it wrong, and uh, they have warned us that there is rain on its way. Shouldn't be bad enough in any sense meaningfully to impact on the game of football, but it is a factor to be taken into consideration. Plenty of other factors, of course, principally each side's concern for the strengths of the other. We survey Milan's famous Curva Sud, one of the truly great shrines of the beautiful game. Milan have gone with what looks like an orthodox 4-4-2, Jim. Well, the modern version of that is a lot more fluid and flexible than in bygone times. There's a much greater understanding of the need for players to cover forward running and it enables risk-taking while the gaps are filled. I'm very much a fan of it. There are a lot of people who seem to have kind of ignored it and just put it to bed, but it still works. It's still valid. And I think we're going to see it be successful here. As you can see, we've already started here. Milan cannot consider the option of defeat. It's not a question of want, but must. Promising cross. And that's been well dealt with. Forward it goes. Well, that's where he wants it. Kessier. Lobato. And Lobato! It's a great exchange. They use the 1-2 to great effect in working their way through the middle then. A little more look though, and they may have been celebrating. He just stood firm. And now the breakaway. Looks to thread it through. Rebic. Up to meet it. Goal! Milan! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Milan have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Because of that first goal now, it's a great opportunity to make it one-way traffic and add to this lead. Rossinone have failed to win any of their last five away games. Lobato. Lobato. Challenge, but fair enough. Hoist it forward. Rossinone going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Milan are cushioned by the confidence of a narrow win in their last game. Milan are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Roberto decides to play it back. And they've been real chance! No mistake! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! That's no fluke, it's what he was there for. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take the risk, as cunning as it comes.
Milan get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Just brushed off the ball there. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Ricky Pooch finds himself back in the starting side for the first time in a while. Rebic looks to dink one in. It's being played forward. Done very well to intervene. Kessier, Lobato, well waiting, surely a shot, oh shooting chance, good clearance and very necessary, Ricky Pooch, Lobato, away from immediate danger, be a throw in. And it's Suso. It's a great ball. Rebic. And he's there to cut it out. Tries to get it forward quickly. Uh, the ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Now it's Suso, Suso. Oh, he's found him in space. Can he find a finish now? He's had a shot. Tries to locate someone up front. Milan have a free kick. Ricky Pooch. Rebic. Lobato has a pop! And the ball's come out! Calls the worry or two. There's the shot. Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Shaping nicely. The only criticism, it could have been three. Milan are in at half time on a comfortable two goal cushion. Here we go again then. So both teams emerge the same as they were before the break. Caldara cuts it out.
Brosilone. And on the receiving end of some fairly harsh criticism, mainly about the tactical choices made by the boss. Yeah, but he brought the criticism upon himself by making substitutions that didn't really make sense. They added confusion when he really needed cohesion. And it's played forward. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Lobato, he's off on a marauding run. Has a hit! It's broken loose. No, no way through there. And that has been clubbed away. Ricky Pooch. Suso. Rebic. Lobato, chip through, Rebic, chance! A great save, real class. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. to safety. Talk about singling someone out. Well, he's the quarterback equivalent, so I'm not surprised that he's been closed down first. Gets good distance on it. And here's Suso. Suso. It's a promising ball. And the finish! Decent enough try. A more than decent attempt, Peter. But there's going to be another change here. Suso. 
Ricky Pooch. Ricky Pooch goes looking. Out to the right. Now it's Suso. Dinks what should it go? Ricky Pooch. Hernandez. And it's Blaszczykowski. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. And he's whipped it in low. And that goes for goal! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Well, it was hit with great power, Peter, but sadly, not great precision. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Piontek. Gets wrestled off the ball. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. He could be in here. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. It's a fabulous position. Leading by two, and the finishing line in sight. Rebic, oh, that's a foul, free kick's been given. Straight out wide, battles to win it back. Just five minutes remaining now. Ricky Pooch. Piontek. Rebic. Goes direct to the front line. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Rebic. A heavy challenge. He's making good... And there goes the final whistle. Milan did it. Terrific team effort to satisfy both the boss and the fans. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Yeah, and a result that was true to form. A big team beating a, a not-so-big team, and the lesson dealt. So that's it for today. Thank you, Jim. And good afternoon, all.
Well, good day to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd, though, are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. The stands here, the Corva, as the locals call them, make for quite an impressive sight, all in support of the grand old lady of the Italian game. Juventus have been in fine fettle of late, which can only add further to an already eagerly awaited encounter. Well, when you come up against opposition that have the momentum and confidence that this team has, you have to form a plan. And in this instance, it has to be about sending an extremely quick car into heavy traffic. Defensive numbers can help pull it off, and while it may not sound the most exciting approach, there's an art to good defence too, we must remember that and they have to get it right. And that gets things running. So this is round two between these two sides who have already met once this season. Piontek. Lobato. Lobato has a look to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Juventus has the league's best defensive record. Kessier. Milan have so far dropped a grand total of just four points this season. Two draws, and they've won the rest. And it's Blaszczykowski. Lobato. Cristiano Ronaldo. Matuidi, Ramsey, Juventus have their manager to thank for the last result. I think, Peter, we have to give credit where it's due. He had a problem up top and he tweaked the system to sort it out. And what I like is that he doesn't hold back. He's got that who dares wins mentality and he really goes for it. Nyingalan. Pretty cagey early on from both sides. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Foden, Piontek. Now it's Blaszczykowski. Has a goal! Great effort, but no way through. Alexander. Nyingalan. Neither side yet able to find the net. Rabio, Nyingalan, Nyingalan threads one through. Alexandro delivers across. He's had a goal! Vital has been included in the starting 11 for the first time in some weeks. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Well played, he saw that coming. Keeper's got good distance on that. Hoists it forward. Nyingalan. Ramsey. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Foden, Piontek, Lobato, Giannini gets it away, and it's 
Cristiano Ronaldo. Matuidi. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Chiellini. The referee's awarded a free kick. Cristiano Ronaldo. Nyingalan. There were better options before the ball was lost. Easy to save from up here, I know. Chiellini tries to get it forward quickly. That's Cristiano Ronaldo. He's looked long this time. Cleared without complication. He's there to receive it. Cristiano Ronaldo! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Piontek. Chiellini. moment you felt that was going somewhere but they'll have to go again Rabio forward it goes he spotted the run and played him through and the whistle goes for half time and both sides have drawn blanks have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Well, no. Here we go again, then. A tight old game so far. Can that change now? Kessier. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's Matuidi. Now it's Higuain. Good. Yeah, he's fouled in there. And helps available out wide. Higuain. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Lobato. Blaszczukowski. Tries lifting it over. Zuma can get it clear. Juventus can make their change now with uh, a break in play. Chiellini. Ramsey. And here's Mandzukic. He gets past his man. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Ah, oh, he's given it away.
out for a throw. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Loose ball, who's going to get that? And Jukic gets it back. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Nyingalan. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Big chance! It's broken loose! Oh, what a ball! Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. So there's going to be another change here. Alexandro. Piontek battles to win it back. Dybala was in the starting side last time out. Nyingalan. No breakthrough and well into the second period. It is still anyone's game. Nothing wrong with that tackle. Ball won cleanly. Rabio. Alexandro. Rabio. Chiellini. Closing in on the last quarter of an hour. De Chilio. Gets wrestled off the ball. De Chilio is fouled. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. Squeeze it out of harm's way. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Just brushed off the ball there. Blaszczykowski. Milan showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. few waiting for it. Chiellini is there and he can get that clear. It's got through and... Concentration levels are very good and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. That'll be a throw. Juventus are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real on a shift.
Piontek. You wonder if that's it now, but there may be one more opportunity, Peter, for a late, late steal here. Dybala. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And that's clear cut. It's a free kick. De Chilio. And it's Rabio. That's a foul, no two ways about it. Has shown him a yellow card. Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Ronaldo with the short one. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Has a hit! And the whistle goes, so nearly a telling finale, but it ends nil-nil. And it looked nil-nil from a fair way out. A little craft or guile or penetration. Defence is largely untroubled. It's goals. Your reflections then, Jim. Yeah, this looked the most likely outcome, but we've had a, a good variety in this game, despite it being anticlimactic. So just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.